A Tampa business owner is pledging to pay his employees who are not working because of the ban on dining in at Florida restaurants. ABC Action News reporter Julie Salamone with why the decision was not hard for him. Peter Taylor uses fresh ingredients. He doesn't take help from a microwave and admits he hates putting pizza in a box. The second that a pizza comes out of the oven, it's dying. So part of me is philosophically opposed to doing to go. No one wants to eat out of a box. But now at Wood Fired Pizza in Tampa, customers may only order carry out or get delivery. The governor ordered all restaurants across the state to stop customers from dining inside, a move to help stop the spread of coronavirus. I feel like we're being singled out a little bit, but my people, my team that's been with me for a while, they didn't deserve to be singled out. They deserve to have a job. And that's the message. Taylor says he took out a line of credit and will continue to pay his 12 employees, even if they are not working. It's the right thing to do. I mean, listen, anybody can be generous when everything's going great. But the time to be generous is when the chips are down. Ashley Smith is used to socializing and greeting customers. So I've got a large Dante's, a large Tampa Verde. Now her job consists of taking orders by phone. At least I know that I still have a job. Unfortunately for a lot of the restaurant workers, hospitality workers, that's not an option. Taylor says his business is down anywhere between 40 to 70 percent depending upon the day. But he says his restaurant remains open for carryout or delivery. Reporting in Tampa, Julie Salmon, ABC Action News.